Good evening, everybody. It was an electric atmosphere tonight at the American Bank Center with the Islanders facing McNeese in a first place matchup on ESPN U. So national TV game. The Islanders looking to even up the standings with the Cowboys atop the Southland here. First half action. Gary Clark going to get the feed and he's going to drive it to the rack. Throw it down, big man. Then Later in the half, the lob to Steven Jiwa. The Islanders with the lead over McNeese. 31-30 at the break. Good crowd on hand. Now, start of the second half, all NMCC the tip. And then the kick out to Jordan Roberts for three. The Islanders went on a 17-0 run to start the second half. They go up 18. McNeese went 10 minutes without a field goal. But here come the Cowboys, the play that changes everything. DJ Richards Jr., the three and the foul. That changed the momentum. Now McNeese fighting all the way back to get within two in the final seconds. Mike Saunders Jr. driving, and he's fouled intentionally. Jordan Roberts thought they were up three. They weren't. They were up two. Now it's a one-point game. The free throw to tie it. No good. Look at Dion right for it. It went right through his hands. And then McNeese, the putback to win it. Oh, the Cowboys rally from 18 down in the second half to stun the Islanders. 62-61 the final. The Cowboys now have a two-game lead over a &MCC, Their first win over the Islanders since 2013. Wow, 16-game losing streak snapped. A heartbreaker for Jim Shaw's team.